Hello friends, welcome back. Today's video is a requested one. I do it every single year. You guys love it and I love filming it and I can't believe that the summer has come to a close and it is time to film it. But that is my back to school video. If you've never seen me before, hello, my name is Sarah and I have two daughters. My oldest is Olive and she will be 10 in November and she's going into fourth grade and my youngest is Eleanor and she's seven and she's going into second grade. Um, I've been doing this, I believe, since they were in preschool and so I basically just share with you guys all the goodies that they will be taking into the new school year. So that's backpacks, lunch boxes, lunch items, um, shoes, clothes, hair accessories, all the little fun goodies here and there um, to share with you guys and give you some inspiration for your littles and love little guys and little ladies in your life as well as give you links to shop items if you see fit. Um, like I said, I try to link everything below. If there is an item that's missing, it's either typically sold out or the link has disappeared because sometimes that happens with a particular site. Um, but I try to make sure that I find like a dupe or something similar, but everything should be linked for you below. Um, and I did this in kind of like one fell swoop this year. It was like a couple of online shopping stints and then one day we went out and the girls kind of just found everything that their little heart desired. So it was a good day. Okay, I'm gonna put my hair back because it's 100 and something degrees out. And then we are gonna dive right in. Um, I'm gonna share with you guys their backpacks and lunch boxes and fun things like that first. And then we will go into each individual kid in their clothes. So let's get started. I'm gonna share with you guys Ollie's backpack first. She picked this really pretty like cottage core style um, or coquette, or, you know, the the vibe for this year. Um, a little corduroy backpack from Amazon. It has all these like little yellow ditzy flowers on it. I don't, my, it keeps focusing on my face. Anyway, it's so gosh darn cute. It's really, really like soft. I don't, I mean, that's not necessarily what you're looking for in a backpack, but it's really nice. Um, and this had really high reviews on Amazon. So I'm very optimistic. She's pretty hard on her um, backpacks. And the one from last year barely made it to the end of the year. So I'm hoping we get a good solid year out of this but it's super duper cute ollie is definitely my more um simple subtle little lady she doesn't like a whole lot of bold giant colors and patterns and anything that's really loud and noisy she likes things that are really soft and feminine um whereas eleanor is the complete opposite and she loves to be loud and proud <laughs> so she picked this really cute care bears backpack from target this was 29.99 but i believe i got it during one of their backpack sales they have them like non-stop around now so definitely check online to see if or in your local target to see if it's on sale but it's really really cute it's nice quality um and i can't wait like i think this is just so her too and the other one is so perfectly ollie she's also um already you know gone crazy and decorated with all of her keychains because she loves to accessorize so for lunch boxes this is ollie's lunch boxes it's a really cute like little my melody sanrio um kind of like purse style lunch box i don't really know what to call this stuff Style. Um, but it's absolutely adorable. We bought this off of Amazon um, and the only thing I'm slightly concerned about is the fact that it's kind of that odd shape, although very cute and works perfectly for like stackable small containers, but for her like bento box, um, I don't think it's going to fit. So we do have an old lunchbox that we can pull out and use just in case, um, but this one is definitely Ollie and so very cute. Um, and then we made keychains recently and she put that on there to accessorize it so it's very cute and then eleanor um decided to go the opposite direction just like usual and decided to pick a very giant lunchbox <laughs> so this is from igloo it's the care bears uh collab that they did and it's like the vintage care bear style it is so gosh darn cute we could pack a whole picnic in here but it is so adorable like I if I had a lunchbox this would be the one that I wanted to so we can fit just about everything in this sucker um, but I got this off of Amazon for a pretty decent price I really really like it and I'm really hoping that we can take good care of this and we can continue using it because it's so gosh darn cute um, and then she threw on this random keychain that I don't even know where she got it from um, next, I did pick up a couple of like lunch accessories from the Cat and Jack line from Target, and we always pick up a new set of 
ice packs. These were the little flower set that they had this year because inevitably um, we end up losing some and getting lost in translation and they get thrown away. So I always have to restock them. Um, I then also picked up a pair of these like little cutlery sets. I normally just throw a random fork or spoon in there, but I thought this was just a better way to keep everything kind of organized um, and nothing getting punctured because that's been happening. So instead, I got this little case. These are like also like four and a half dollars or something around there. And it comes with a fork, a spork, I think, and, or a spork, yeah, spork, a spoon, and a little set of chopsticks, which I think is so cute. And then the little lid is a little flower design. So I got two of those and then, to match that flower design, I got these little nested snack containers. Um, it comes in a pack of three and we can put, you know, fruit and dips and all sorts of stuff or their little snack during the school day. But I just thought these were so gosh darn cute. Again, these were about four and a half dollars. Um, and I love the Cat and Jack lunch lines every single year. I think they have the cutest prints and they're just so much fun. So I was really excited about these this year. All right, now we are going to jump into clothes. I'm going to share with you Ollie's first. The first thing I am going to share with you guys are shoes. So she picked out these two pairs of shoes. They were having a 20% off sale at Target, which I believe they are still having right now. Um, but she picked these two pairs of flats. And if anything, I will say is that this is the most representational of her clothing choices. Um, light pink and white-ish cream. So these are both from the Cat and Jack line. We get these little ballet flats constantly and whenever they outgrow them and we donate them and then we buy a new pair because I just love them so much. They're really comfortable. They hold up really well. They're so pretty. They come in a bunch of different colors. Um, and these were... $14.99 and then they were 20% off. So she picked out these really pretty little white ones. And then she also picked out these kind of like Mary Jane style ones and there's really pretty baby pink patent leather set. And these were $19.99, I believe. Yes, 20% off. I find that the Cat and Jack shoe line typically runs larger, um, or at least for her, because she's normally like in a two and both of these are in a one with room to spare. We also, I also got her a pair of new sneakers. She loves just a good basic like white kid. So that's what she ha is getting, um, but they haven't come in yet. However, just a little easy breezy pair of white Keds that she has now, we've purchased these multiple times every time she outgrows them um, because they are just, they work so well for her and she loves them. So a little pair of white sneakers. Okay, let me preface with saying about her clothes. Um, she loves to go big or go home. She may be subtle in the colors and the patterns, but she loves to be fancy and she doesn't care if it is a school day, she is going to dress to impress. So just keep that in mind when I share with you some of these items because some of you are gonna be like, why would she wanna wear that to school? But it's because she likes it and that's all that matters and I support her fully. So the first place is from Kohl's. We don't shop there too often, but we had the 20% coupon when you take stuff back to Amazon. So we did pick up a couple of things. We picked up this little Halloween spooky tea because they had their Halloween teas out and she loved the Mew Mews on it, the cats. Um, so she picked up this and then we got just a really comfy pair of biker shorts to kind of go with it. They're ombre um, and they're this really pretty like baby pink and orange um, and it fits perfectly with this shirt. Now October in Texas, you never know what's going to be. This will probably be totally fine with a cardigan. We'll see what happens, but it nonetheless is a cute little spooky outfit for her to wear um, for the spooky season. She also picked up a pair of these jeans. They're these really cute distressed um, flares and they were on clearance for $16 and then I think they were even marked down lower than that at checkout. Um, but she's got short little leggies like her mama and so um, they're a little bit longer on her but they're really comfortable and she can grow into them and they have an adjustable waist which is really nice because I find a lot of things in like eight and up don't anymore um, and so she was pleasantly happy with them and she's incredibly picky so if she liked it we were gonna get it um, but I don't know if I'll be able to link those because they were on clearance but I will try. The next thing we picked up was this really pretty kind of I don't know, crochet, knit cardigan, not crochet, whatever, a knit cardigan. It's baby pink, it's from Jumping Beans. Um, and this was on clearance for $10 when it was originally $18.99. It's a little oversized as well, but she, that's what she likes and it's something she can grow into. Um, and she would probably have every cardigan on the planet if she could. And then she picked up this really cute Hello Kitty tee. 
just basic cute she loves collecting sanrio teas and then this is probably closer to a wintry outfit for her um but it was just so pretty that we couldn't resist so it's this pair of flare leggings these are from jumping beans um and i love the little lettuce trim at the bottom there's really pretty baby pink ribbed leggings and then this really pretty like square neck um i don't even know what that pattern is but that kind of that like little pokey pattern <laughs> know how to describe it with these little lace detailing it's just so pretty um so cute this just gives me ballerina in winter time and i just i loved it so and she loved it too and it looks so pretty on her so we got that even though it's definitely way too hot to be wearing it now but soon enough it will work okay that was all that we got from kohl's so we're going to move on to old navy um old navy we've had a couple of things that i purchased like way earlier in the summer um and then a couple things that were more recent but i picked up these pair of these really pretty kind of linen style shorts really lightweight perfect for the hot weather right now but they have these like really pretty flowers on them and this scalloped embroidered trim adorable and then this little white or white pink tank top it's ribbed and i love these this like new like trend there's hair everywhere i'm so sorry this new trend where they have like little cutouts and so it like peaks against your skin tone i just think it's so pretty um and so we got this little one for her and it goes perfectly with her little shorts so again this is just an easier outfit that she can wear when it's super hot and she doesn't really want to be going <laughs> and then i also picked up this cute little tank top for her um, it has these little beads. This is something that she can wear over like a white t-shirt. She can wear it by itself. They did change the dress code. Every time I film this video, normally I tell you guys that they can't wear spaghetti straps or tank tops. They finally changed the dress code. And as long as everything is covered, then they're good to go with the, you know, the spaghetti straps or tank tops, which makes me so happy. Um, and it just makes everything a lot easier for them to wear and they won't be so hot. So I love these little tank tops though, or these spaghetti straps because they're like beads. This is such a good idea. It's so cute so like perfect for like the friendship bracelet trend this year i just loved it so this is from old navy like i said and she can wear this with a bunch of different things but it was too cute to resist and then the last thing i think i picked up from her for her at old navy was um this little set and this is so gosh darn cute but it's this little bow like fit and flare dress um and it has pockets i love the little fit and flare dresses and then it comes with a pair of baby pink leggings. So she can wear the little dress by itself right now. And then as it gets closer to the fall, she can um, put on the little leggings with some like cute little boots or little Uggs or something adorable and a little cardigan. But I just love this set. She loves everything like ballerina and coquette and all of that vibe right now. So anything with bows and baby pink is perfect for her. And this was such a cute set. I think this was on sale for like 10 bucks definitely recommend it i really like it and then at target she picked up a couple things as well we picked up yet another hello kitty item this is a cute little hello kitty baby tee and it's embroidered um i loved it this was ten dollars which i thought was such a good deal and then i think everything was on sale like 20 percent off or so um when we shopped but really cute and then we also picked up yet another hello kitty item <laughs> This is a little Hello Kitty sweatshirt. Um, she was really excited about this. The only thing I'm concerned about is it is so incredibly soft. It's like butter, but I'm scared of how it's going to wash. So this may be a ha hand wash item. I'm just, I'm worried that it's gonna like snag and get all pilly and we'll see how it wears, but it's very, very cute and cozy. So she picked that one up and then um, she also got another cardigan. Um, this is from the art class line and it's very pretty. It's perfect for the, this time of year as well as we transition to fall and then into spring. Um, and it's just nice and lightweight. It's not too heavy, not too chunky where it's going to be really like cozy and warm. This will be just like nice little topper. And then last, but oh no, we have two more things. She picked up also these pair of, um, denim shorts from art class they have these like acid wash prints of like little flowers all over them they're very very cute she really liked them and the way they kind of like flared out um and then she likes the little distressing or like the little fringe on the hem 
And then this was on clearance. There were so many items on clearance that we were lucky to snag. Um, this was $7 and it is this cute little tank top. I actually got the blue and white one for her um, earlier, like in the very beginning of summer. And so this one is perfect for her too. And she was really excited. So just something easy again that she can just wear to school. And the last store we shopped at was um, Shein and we found so many beautiful things and her like little heart and little dreams were coming true with all the items that we found. Um, she has a still, they both have still a ton of clothes that they can fit into from last year so we didn't need to go crazy but this is just kind of added to transition as they continue to grow um, but these are so pretty. Okay so we picked up this really cute little um, ribbed blouse and it has these real little red flowers on it. We have one really similar with a yellow print and we have one I think with a purple print. So this is a top that she really likes and it's really comfortable on her. It is definitely cropped so she has to wear something that's like higher waisted and so it goes really well with these cute little striped little skirt. Um, it go like just you know cross over and then just little shorts in the back it's just so cute and this obviously can go with a bunch of different things as well but it's nice and lightweight um perfect for this time of year but i just thought it was so cute and such a fun way to mix patterns and then um this was a two-piece set but it came with this really fun like layered ruffled skirt that's baby pink and just makes me think of a cupcake and then it came with this matching bow top and you're gonna see bows and bows and more bows um this is kind of big the skirt's perfect but this shirt is definitely a little bit on the bigger side for her um i believe this was a size seven um but it's definitely something she can grow into and still looks really cute and it's really 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 soft and really comfortable so it's adorable Next, I picked up this other little bow tank top. Again, it's made of that, it's like this material. I don't know what it is. It's so soft like butter um, and it's nice and thick, um, but not like really heavy. I don't know. Anyway, it has a bunch of little bows on it and then this really cute like eyelet um, scallopy lace trim on the shoulders and then the bottom. And then she can wear with a bunch of different things, but just a cute basic little tank. And then this really pretty little floral um, kind of like peasant style dress Again something that's just really lightweight that she can wear right now when it's really hot and then as it gets a little bit cooler She can pop on with like a cute little cardigan This is one thing that she wanted so badly and I'm so glad that she got it and it looks so pretty on her It's this beautiful little floral um, Kind of like tea style type of dress to me it's just so adorable i love the little neckline with the little bow the straps are adjustable it looks so cute on her and then we also got one more kind of like tea party style dress like i said go big or go home for ollie she loves wearing dresses to school it's how she feels most comfortable we just pair her biker shorts underneath and she just has a day um and this is the other one and i just i love this one too i love the little lace edges and then the little flutter sleeves and this one has this big green bow in the back and the bow is actually removable which is really nice if she doesn't want to wear it one day but i definitely think that it adds a little something something but again just a really pretty nice lightweight dress that transitions really well for the temperature here next is this little dress i honestly i just i couldn't resist buying it um it was just so pretty i don't know what she's going to wear it for um but it is this kind of like off the shoulder but with like little spaghetti straps baby pink dress with these little black bows it just it's so pretty um and it just flares out into kind of this like little a-line cut it's a little bit longer it goes past her knees it's so pretty on her um so cute this i think was her favorite item i think i think this one was her favorite um and it's just so fun i again she could wear her picture today. She could wear, I don't know. She could wear, she was just excited about it. I also picked up this really pretty little, again, layered ruffle skirt. This one is a kind of like off-white color. It has layered lace in it too. And it just looks so pretty and like a little, gives me like Marie Antoinette vibes. And I just, I love it. I think it's beautiful. She looks so cute in that. She has so many things to pair it with. And then this is one of my favorite things. It's this pink bow dress it just makes me think of barbie and all things happy and girly 
it is so cute and so like flattering and just again really lightweight perfect for this time of year it just makes me so happy um this is easily something that you could put over a little t-shirt again wear it with a little cardigan um or on its own and i love it and then we have this little tank top that I got for her to go with one of her like high-waisted skirts. So we haven't found a top to wear yet. So this is definitely cropped, but on her, it fits her really well. Um, but it's this really pretty, again, off-white little crop with this really beautiful satin bow. It is so pretty um, and it fits perfectly with her little like high-waisted, um, makes you think of like a Bridgerton skirt. It's so cute. We got it last year and we just have not found a top for it. So this is perfect. And then the last two items for Ollie are a set again. This, we couldn't, the ruffle skirt was like her thing this year. So we picked up another one and this has this beautiful blue floral detail. It's a bit more of like a cream color um, in the background. And then again, it's layered and ruffled with like these lace detailing on the end. This makes me think of Bridgerton. And it came with this really pretty kind of eyelet style baby blue um, lull tank top so cute oh I love it and then last but not least this one's probably my favorite and probably what you'll wear for picture day but I got this black little tee just a basic tee but it has these really pretty kind of like chiffon style um flutter sleeves and then this skirt is just what dreams are made of like I want this as an adult but it's this beautiful kind of like tea length cream chiffon skirt with these little adorable satin black bows on it it is so cute on her she wears it with like a little pearl necklace oh i love it this is perfect for picture day it's so so beautiful perfect also for the holidays coming um i love it it's my favorite thing i think we have and then I did pick her up a set of bows. I also picked her up another set, but I don't know where they are. Those were from Shein, but this one is from Target. These were $6, but I wanna say these were also on sale, but they're just a set of art class bows. They're just these really pretty different shades of blue. We have a bunch of pink, but we don't have any blue. And with multiple things that she owns that are blue, but also more things that we've recently added, I just thought these were perfect. Um, they always share their hair accessories. So even if these are technically like bought with Ollie like they end up sharing and they all kind of just go in a big bucket um but I love these I think they're so cute all right so my camera died and I lost the second battery so I had to wait to charge a little bit but now we're getting back into it so now we're officially going to switch over to Eleanor um and I'm going to share with you the couple of things that we picked up from Kohl's we only got a, like three things from there uh, for her she wasn't super in love with everything there but I did pick her up this really cute Halloween shirt for her this one says trick-or-treat and I love the one the checkered but also I love the like kind of classic um, vintage style Halloween illustration. That's like my very favorite. I think it's so cute. So I was really excited for this. The girls wear Halloween like themed clothes every day uh, for the month of October and we commit we commit to the theme they do it every single day and so we normally add a couple of things every year that they can wear that's a little bit bigger so they can have them for the following years. So. That was one of the shirts we picked up and then she picked up this one she really really wanted this one it's huge on her <laughs> but they didn't have the smaller size um and she was not leaving without it but it's just this kind of like swirl care bear themed thing as you can very well tell with her backpack and lunchbox care bears are her vibe this year um and the last thing that she also refused to leave the store without was this she loves sweatshirts um she would wear them every single day even in 100 degrees she doesn't care she loves them so we got this cute little tie-dye um mustang little sweatshirt that she loved so much and it was on clearance for 1440 um it was originally 36 but i want to say that this was also another item that um ended up being cheaper at the register like even lower clearance so definitely worth it she's really excited and loves it so that's all that matters Next, we will move on to Old Navy. I picked up a couple of bottoms for her. I love their flared leggings um, on Ellie, and she really likes them too because they typically run a little bit longer, I find. So I found this really, really cute pair of like ribbed 
flared leggings and I love the little lettuce trim at the bottom but most importantly the cute little tie-dye it's so adorable they came in I think two other colors and I'm contemplating getting the others um, because these look so cute on her and they, she said they were really comfortable so I liked those and then I also picked up this pair which this these are typically the ones we normally get it's just like the basic style leggings but they're flared at the ends um, and they're checkered and if you guys know I can't stop with the checkered that's all I love and I've got her like super into it too so they're just like lime green little checkered ones so cute and to go along with that I found this kind of like cut out tank it has like the shoulders are kind of cut out um, and it's so cool she looks so good in like bright neon and like fun pops of color it just pops so well against her skin tone and so those are perfect for those little leggings and then I picked her up yet another checkered item. <laughs> this is a cute little dress. I think this was meant to be like a swimsuit cover up, but it's fully opaque and it's just so cute that I don't care. Um, but again, it's this little pink, hot pink, like little checkered kind of terry cloth style um, spaghetti strap little dress. It's pretty long. Um, she again can wear this over a t-shirt. She can wear it by itself, but I just thought it was really cute and something really easy. And she also got this little skirt um, it is like, um, again, it has like that terry cloth little like pops in it and then cotton everywhere else. I don't know. Anyway, but it has little smiley faces all over it. Um, and this has shorts underneath that are attached. So she has a bunch of graphic tees and tanks and stuff she can pair with this. But again, I try to get her with a lot more bottoms because I feel like she outgrows her bottom so quickly because of her long legs. Um, and then... I, I picked her up this shirt which says um peace love and fries and that is the most Eleanor thing of Eleanor's so um so cute and then I got her a tank top just like Ollie's that has a little cutout with the hot pink heart in the center which pops so nicely again against her skin tone and then I loved the ringer style trend this year I bought a bunch in it and I bought a bunch for the girls because I just think it's so cute um and so I picked up this little athletic skirt for her in it it's so nice the quality of this skirt is so nice it is so cute and this also um does come with built-in shorts as well um but I loved this it looks so cute on her and then um yet another checkered <laughs> item this is a ribbed checkered dress this was kind of like a midi dress this looks so cute and so flattering on her i love it so much um i do believe that it came in a couple of different checkered colored prints but i really liked this kind of terracotta e rust brown i just thought it was kind of unique um and it's so cute i want this in my size i love this and then last but not least, this is something I do almost like every year. Old Navy a lot of times will mark down their like flannels and they typically still have them in stock in the early summer for like four bucks. And then they bring them back again when the fall hits and they're full price. So I try to like hit it when the sale is and I can get them for next to nothing. And I picked up this flannel for Eleanor. She only is the one like flannels, always will not wear flannels, but Eleanor loves them. And this makes me think of Boy Meets World. It just makes me so happy, nostalgic. It's so cute. Um, this is a size small it's really large though so it's perfect for her to kind of wear over her like clothes as like a little shacket if you will and then also to tie around her waist but she loves flannels and loves to dress them up and down and stuff and so she was a fan but getting that for like four bucks that's when you shop for them all right we are moving on to target i picked her up this hello kitty kind of thermal um yes it's long sleeves and it's definitely going to be way too hot for a while but um, they have this new Sanrio collection in Target and they're so cute and I just didn't know if it still would be around by the time it got cold enough to wear it. So um, she got this and was really excited about it. Really adorable. They have a bunch of different Sanrio prints and friends and all that sort of stuff. So if you are a little one in your life, love Sanrio, check it out. Um, she found this in clearance. It's just this basic little cami tank top that's ribbed and it's embroidered with a little cowboy boot that says howdy. I think it's so cute and it was on clearance for $7 um, and I loved it too. So she picked up that. And then we also picked up at the front of the store, they had like a complete sequestered section all from 
it wasn't next to any of the other clothes so i don't really know why but they had a bunch of just random like solid little like mix and match pieces like shorts and pants and tanks and anyway eleanor found this one and it's just this, again this bright lime green which looks so good on her skin and it's really really soft it's a terry cloth material and the inside is so fuzzy and soft and comfortable but then the outside's kind of ribbed um and it's just really cute it's like a little v-neck neckline and looks so cute on her um and then I totally scored with this. I was so excited. This was in the clearance section and I wanted to grab the girls one of these um, before they sold out and I totally missed my chance, but I found it in the clearance. I was so excited and it was on clearance for $4.50. So always check the clearance section. Um, and I think it's just so cute and both girls can fit this. Um, so they'll both kind of share this, but it's just this really cute little cargo mini skirt. And then the last bit of things from Target she picked up this Rainbow Bright baby tee, which I love. I think it's so cute. I love this shirt. Um, and she got it to go with these cargo pants. These are from Cat and Jack. And they look like denim, but they feel almost like linen. They're really, really soft and really comfortable. They're not heavy and like too structured and uncomfortable like denim. They feel like almost like linen pants. Um, and they look so cute on her she pairs this two together and this is probably my favorite outfit i love it she looks absolutely adorable but these were from cat and jack for 18 dollars. i want to get her more because i love these so much on her they're so cute all right moving on to the last shop for ellie and that was from shein um i picked her up a number of like bottoms because again i feel like she grows out of her bottoms way faster than her shirts because her legs just grow so rapidly um i picked up uh, two t-shirts to kind of mix and match with these pair of bottoms and the first one i picked up was <laughs> this one it says pizza delicious i couldn't stop like i would add this to my cart and take it out and then add this to my cart and take it out and just makes me think of like an 80s pizza joint advert or something it's just so cute i couldn't I couldn't resist. I loved it too much. And then I picked up this really cute um, girl power shirt that just made me really happy. Um, and I just love the red and it's just so simple. And to go with it, I picked up these really cute little like gingham style shorts. These are like all the rage I feel like from kids all the way to adults. Um, and these have like really sweet little ruffled edges and then like a kind of a paper bag, elastic waisted ruffle waist they're really really lightweight i love these i have a pair of these too but for my size and i just think they're so cute you can pair them with so many things but they're so comfortable so i got her this and i have a matching set of bows and i don't know where they are but it kind of all just goes with the look so i love this little set next i picked her up this little midi like pleated slash ribbed skirt it's fun and rainbow the colors are less pastel in person they're a bit more bright and vibrant than it's coming off online um but it's again really silky and fun and lightweight and would pair really well with that target little ribbed crop i think would look really cute with that and then she picked up or i picked up this little tank for her as well this is this really fun floral like 70s style tank um and then i got it to go with these like fuchsia hot pink little shorts kind of skort i love like that skorts are back in style because they're just really easy and they're super cute but then you know they're easy to wear and you don't have to wear shorts underneath it um for school and things and then um i picked her up this is one of my other favorite sets that uh, or outfits that she has it came in a set a two-piece set and it's these little pair of shorts they're super flowy again they're like this pleated accordion style with little bow elastic waist um and then it comes with this cropped top that matches um but it's kind of boxy and oversized on her and it buttons in the back but it's so gosh darn cute it's in this cool like kind of tie-dye marbly graphic-y i don't know modern <laughs> um print and it's just it looks so good we did a fun like hair dye and bottoms of their hair um this summer and it was meant to just be for the summer we're gonna cut it off but she wants to wear it to school and it's like a fun green like lime green color and it looks so good against this i love that outfit um she also wanted to get more pleated skirts like her sister 
um, and so I picked up this really comfy like white pleated tennis skirt um, or skirt because this also has shorts underneath it. I love getting the skirts like these off of um, Shein because I can get so many different ones at great prices and so many different colors and they last really really well. Um, that's what Ollie has had so many of and she loves them still. Um, and I got her this She's also really wanted a rugby tee and I got her this little rugby polo um, that is like baby pink. It's a bit more like boxy and cropped. This just brings me back to when I was a kid and like the rugby tees or the rugby long sleeves. I think they were from Target. I can't really remember but I want to say they were like the Mossimo ones and they were long sleeve. They were like all the rage when I was a kid and so it's so fun to see them kind of come back but this looks so cute paired with the little white tennis skirt. And then I also picked her up this really pretty strawberry dress um, and I love the little top that has like the lace with the cute bow and it's like this nice little maxi length dress on her with all of these strawberries um, and the straps are ribbon and it's just it's so cute so I picked her up this and then I also picked her up this really pretty green gingham again that kind of like um, cottage core style dress and I love the fabric it's just this really cute like cotton um, checkered green like baby lime green baby lime lime green denim with these like painted daisies on it um, this looks so good on her this is one that I think is so flattering it looks stunning I love this one on her and then I got this but I wanted to send it back but she really liked it so we just went ahead and kept it but it is this bow dress and I love the bows. I think the bows are so cute. I love the blue, the like royalish kind of baby blue color. Um, but the sleeves are just really big and voluminous. She's very, very petite and she's very small shoulders. Um, and so I feel like it's a bit like kind of like all up in her face, but she loves it. So we decided to keep it um, and I know she'll wear it. But anyway, that's cute. It just wasn't my fave out of everything else. And then I think Last but not least, I had a couple more things and I don't know where they went. But last but not least for clothes, I got her these pair of pants and I love them so much. They, again, make me think of Lizzie McGuire and Miranda. Um, and they're these hot pink like denim pants that have these like printed, um, or like almost like dyed parts of these stars and then this deconstructed kind of star right here. Anyway, I love it. I think these are so cute. She loves them too. She says they're really comfortable on. I'm obsessed. And then I got this really cute little like crop tank to go uh, with it. This will definitely be something that she will wear a white like t-shirt underneath, but um, it makes me think of the Powerpuff Girls <laughs> and just makes me so happy. It's so cute and just like girly and pink and I love it and she does too. So this is one of my favorites as well. And then lastly, um, I forgot to share these other pairs of shoes with you. Like I said, she's a sneaker gal and I found these bad boys. Now the camera doesn't do these suckers justice. These are even more like, just like oversaturated almost in person. It looks like you just bumped up the saturation times a hundred. Um, these were like on clearance for like $13 in Target. We just randomly stumbled upon them, stumbled, stumbled upon them. They're memory foam, so they're really nice and supportive and squishy and the soles inside. And if you guys are SJM girlies and have read Crescent City, Bryce has a pair of fuchsia sneakers and they're throughout the whole series. Um, and people have like tried to dupe them and find, you know, similar ones in life in life, in real life. Um, and they're these, these are the Skechers ones. I think there's like the kids version of it, but I was so excited to find these and I was hoping she'd love them and she absolutely did. This was a total hit. And these, I guess, are like, they're, the material is very different. It's diff I haven't ever felt a sneaker like this before or a shoe. It almost feels almost like neoprene, but I guess they're very like easy to wash. They're machine washable and they wash up really well. And I guess they're like scuffered scuff and mark resistant so i think that's really nice so i'm hoping that it helps the longevity of them um but they're really really pretty so and they're like just full like completely hot pink um but they would look so cute with like half of her wardrobe so anyway 
And then last but not least, I did pick up a pair of clips for her. Like I said, I have more clips and I don't know where I put them. Um, hopefully I find them before school starts. But I did get her her own like set as well. And these are from Cat and Jack. And they're little doggies. Um, Ollie is my cat girl, but Ellie is my dog girl. And I have seen like the big claw clips of like the cat claw clip or the dog claw clip. But I haven't seen them in like the little mini ones. And I just thought these were absolutely adorable. So these were also $6, but I bought her a set. And that is officially it. All of their school supplies we actually purchased like through the school at the end of the school year, which saved so much time, energy, stress, and money. And I will forever do that from here on out. But I, sometimes I miss the deadline and I'm so upset, but it's just so much easier. Um, and that's about it. School starts for them in less than a week and I can't believe summer is already over, but I'm excited to kind of get back in the swing of things. I kind of took the summer vacation to just spend time with my girls and soak it up and have fun and make memories, but I'm excited to get back to recording and filming, especially as the fall season approaches. Um, so keep an eye out for my coming videos. Thank you guys so much for being here. I hope that you enjoyed this video. Like I said, I will try to have everything linked for you guys down below so you can shop the links at your leisure. Um, and yeah, thank you so much. And I hope you guys are having a wonderful summer. And if you guys have any littles that are going back to school or if you're going back to school yourself, I hope that you have a wonderful and amazing and safe um, school year that is stress-free and just filled with lots of fun memories and knowledge and all the good things. Um, I hope you're well. I send all my love to you guys, and I will see you guys very soon. Bye, guys.